How do you feel like a day's on today? Well, we're going out to do some creek fishing. And well, I just spent $25 on 15 pair of pliers. Because now I gotta scavenge around the shed to find me a pair of pliers. Because every time that I go fishing, I lose a pair of pliers. I've lost 23 pairs this year. I don't have any left. I have one pair left that's about that big. And I don't really use that for anything but split shot. So, yeah. I gotta find me a pair of pliers somewhere. I don't know where I'm gonna find any yet, but we'll have to see. But I'm gonna find me a pair of pliers and then we're gonna go fish. All right, y'all, well, got me two pair. I got me a real long pair and a real short pair, which the short pair is what I always use. I don't really ever use anything else, but hey, you know. We are gonna use them today. Because if we lose one pair, we got another. So it all works out. All right, y'all, well, I got all my stuff packed up. And um, well, we're heading to the creek now. Um, I'm gonna be the only one fishing today. So hopefully I can catch some big ones, but it's about 5.30 now. I don't really get dogs about nine. So we're getting in here. Hopefully we can go catch some fish. All right, y'all, well, I'm gonna be running a little bit different setup today. So um, I'm gonna be running the GoPro on my head instead of on my chest. I've had a couple of people that um, film tell me that it is much better footage when um, when you film off your head, just from other YouTubers I've met while I've been fishing. So that's what they say. So I had to try it out, but um, we'll see today. All right, y'all. Well, this is weird running a head cam while fishing, but they record no. But we're gonna go ahead and get to fishing. So we made it to the creek. I started at a different place. I normally start at the bridge, but I started down here today. So we'll see. Oh, there's a nice one. Well, so right nice bluegill right there, or a green sunfish. Ooh, he just peed all over me. Well, there we go, y'all. Pretty one. Let's see if we can get some more. There's one. Ha ha. There we go. Double hooks. He didn't get all three, but he did get two. Well. Yep, there went that. Just like the rest of my day. Oh, there's like five bass in this hole. And they are like swinging and swiping, but they will not eat it. There's one. All right, y'all, well, I think we just discovered a prehistoric hip bone of a deer. It looks really old. I don't know how old it actually is, but it looks really old. Pretty cool looking. Well, there's two in that hole. Well, there we go. Little old fall fish. Well, there we go. I think that's number four on the day. There was two in this hole, so maybe we can go back and get him. Well, the second one, anyways. No, he don't want to undo it. Holy smokes. That was a big old knot of head right there. <clears throat> Get him back. Hey. That's a big one. Well, y'all, this is not the fish I had flash on it, but hey, this works. It's a little old creek chub. I was literally picking it up out the water, and I he just came off and smoked, and I didn't get to set the hook on him. Well, I wish this fall fish would come back. He was a stud. But I might slip up and still get him, y'all. You never know. He flashed on it and then followed it twice, but he wouldn't eat it. Oh, that's a good one. I don't know, I hate to say it, but that... Huh, he's been caught before. That's possibly the one I've seen flash, but I didn't think he was that small. I mean, that's probably a 12-inch fish, but still. Not a bad fish, though. Well, there we go. It's not quite a 14-incher, but hey, it's a decent fish. Well, y'all, I see something I don't like. And it's a big of something. You know. Holy smokes. It's a real big of something I don't like. Well, y'all might better tell what that is. Well, that goes all the way down to here. Then it, and then it runs all the way up to here. That's like a four foot snake. Oh, I hate snakes. Yeah, like one of my biggest fears is snakes. I hate them. Um, yeah, well, I gotta get back. 
in the water. Huh. Man, that grosses me out. I hate a snake. Well, caught another crawfish. The same thing we pulled out the water and well, kind of rolled him right there. Well, that was fun. There he is. A good fall fish. I've caught more bigger fish today than I have smaller fish. I'm not mad about that. Well, there we go. It's a nice fall fish. All right, y'all. Well, I know I may not have caught the biggest fall fish or the smallest fall fish today in the most, but I have caught a whole lot bigger ones than I have been catching. So I ain't caught as many as I normally do, but I've caught quite a few that were like 10 inches. Uh, yeah, about 10 inches is the biggest one I've caught, but I think I've caught three like that. So that's right good, but we're still working our way down and got a long ways to go. Got a piece of driftwood, tied it on my bag, so that's pretty cool, but we keep on fishing. Oh, there's one. This one's going nuts though. <laughs> Probably the same one from last time. Last time I was here, I caught one about the same size. And about 10 yards below this. Could be a different fish, but probably the same one. But I don't see any hook holes in him. Well, he's loose. See if we can get him out. Well. I'm going to have to retire this reel as soon as I can afford a new one. Um, and a new one's probably only like 40 bucks, so... I just got to better go to Walmart one day and get one. But this thing keeps messing up on me real bad. It's not the pole, it's the reel. But why not get a whole combo? I have to see which one works out in the cheaper prospect. But we'll see. But this hole, I've always imagined like big fish in this hole. It's a beautiful hole. All these logs, just a bunch of brush. It's a pile of minnows in it. You would just think, big fish. I've never caught a fish out of this hole. It's pretty bad. What in the world is this? Couch cushion? That's what it looks like. Got him. Putting up a little bit of a fight. Or I could just not let him fight. Y'all know, one or the other. Well, there we go. I gotta re retie that. Huh. Little creature. Starting to catch a lot more of them today. I cast in this hole right here at the end of this fast moving water. And you hit it. I don't want to catch many of them on the spinner. That's a nice one, y'all. I don't know exactly how big it is, but it feels. Oh yeah, pretty nice small fish. <laughs> I sure am glad that won't no citation. He got off real easily. There he is. Got to fight him a little while. Yeah, got him. Some pretty fins on him. Little old fall fish. Oh. Having a good day after all. At first, it didn't start off well, and all day ain't been good. And then this evening, well, went fishing. Oh, there he is. Oh, it's a little bass. He came off. Let's see if we can go back in there and get him or the other bigger one that was right behind me. Hmm. Well, neither one of them wanted to hit it. I stepped over this log. My lure was barely hanging in the water and this perch wanted to come and get it. But he didn't take it. Oh, he came back for it. But take it, take it. Come on. You've hit it four times, buddy. It's your turn to take it. Oh, that was probably my chance right there. I didn't I didn't react fast enough. No freaking way. I snagged him. This ain't even the perch. Yeah, that's okay. Snagged him in the bottom of his jaw. Well, there we go. Got a little creep thing. That's it. Hang 
that's a good perch. I will say that is one of the biggest perch I've ever caught in this creek. Dang. If I was to ever mount a perch that would like citation, probably one of these. These are some of the most prettiest perch I've ever seen in this creek. I don't know why, they're just real pretty. There's one. Not a very big one. Oh, he got off. Oh well, catch my release. Really have no idea what I just found, but I found something. It's got a short tail. I was thinking snapping turtle, but that's a tail. Mm. One thing I can guess is muskrat. I don't really have any idea what that is, y'all. It's kind of weird. Mm. He's fighting hard for a little fish. Oh, that's why. <laughs> it's a bass. Well, look at that, y'all. I think this is what they call spotted bass. I still have not quite to identify what these are. There he is. In the deep hole. I almost gave up on it. Right down there is where I caught my last citation. It was about this time, too. I was almost about to give up. And that's when I caught him. All right, y'all. Well, I don't know how much footage I actually got on camera today. I don't really know. Um, these was on my head, so I couldn't tell when it was recorded and when it's not. So it's hard for me to judge that. But hopefully I got enough to make a video. Hopefully it worked for all the fish. I'll have to look at it tonight and see. Well, but on either way, hope you liked today's video. And um, we caught quite a few fish. Um, didn't really catch nothing over 10 inches, everything. It was decent size, it was about 10 inches, so that was fun. And on the way out, I seen 10 deer. So it's good, good crop for next year, I guess you could say. One of them I could tell was a buck. I don't know what the other ones was. But um, either way, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.